Greetings, everybody. Uh, today is Tuesday, and today we continue our daily Psalms for hope, and we're in Psalm 119. Uh, it's Psalm 119 is 176 verses, and so we're taking 16 at a time. And so today we find ourselves at verse 97. So get out your Bibles, and let's look at what these 16 verses have to say. It says, Oh, how I love your law. It is my meditation all the day. Your commandment makes me wiser than my enemies, for it is ever with me. I have more understanding than all my teachers, for your testimonies are my meditation. I understand more than the aged, for I keep your precepts. I hold back my feet from every evil way in order to keep your word. I do not turn aside from your rules, for you have taught me. How sweet are your words to my taste, sweeter than honey to my mouth. Through your precepts I get understanding, therefore I hate every false way. Your word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path. I have sworn an oath and confirmed it to keep your righteous rules. I am severely afflicted. Give me life, O Lord, according to your word. Accept my free will offerings of, of praise, O Lord, and teach me your rules. I hold my life in my hand continually, but I do not forget your law. The wicked have laid a snare for me, but I do not stray from your precepts. Your testimonies are my heritage forever, for they are the joy of my heart. I incline my heart to perform your statutes forever to the end. Well, this, uh, this, this grouping of, of uh, verses uh, certainly um, has a familiar one uh, in it for us, and that is uh, uh, verse 105. It says, your word is a lamp to, to my feet and a light to my path. Uh, songs are written about this verse. And, uh, you know, I... I thought I would meditate on this one today uh, for us because I don't know if you've ever walked in the dark uh, and if you've ever been barefoot walking in the dark uh, can be a pretty uncomfortable uh, situation because uh, if you, if you kind of lose your bearings as to where you are and it is dark, uh, you can stub your toes, you can... Uh, you know, you can, you can do some damage uh, to your feet uh, because of running into things uh, that you don't expect. And so I thought, you know, walking in the dark is, is a good uh, analogy for this because God's word is a lamp to my feet. You know, when you have light uh, and you're walking, uh, you, you can develop a clear path. You can see a clear path. Uh, and that light uh, exposes things so that you don't get hurt. Um, and the same thing with the Word. Uh, the, the Word helps us in those dark times. Uh, I love what the, what the psalmist says here. He says this, this Word... You know, I, because of this word, I have more understanding than all my teachers. Uh, I am wiser than my enemies. I have, I have more understanding than the aged. Uh, you know, so the, the idea is that the word gives us uh, wisdom. It gives us uh, that light for our paths ahead. Because walking in darkness, again, can cause stumbling. Uh, it, can, it can cause a lot of pain sometimes. Um, but when there's light shown on the area that you're walking in, uh, you, you become more aware of those, of those uh, hazards. And it's the same with the Word. The more we're in the Word, the more wisdom we get. The more we're in the word, the more understanding we have of who this God is and, and what, he, what he desires from us. Uh, it exposes the darkness. It exposes sins in our hearts. It exposes uh, uh, paths that uh, we, we ought to be walking in. 
And, uh, you know, the, that's what the Word does to us, uh, especially in those darkened times. And so, you know, I think what the psalmist is trying to get us to understand is that there is, there is a whole lot of, of promise and light uh, within this word, within this book that we have been exploring through these psalms. Uh, this, again, the psalms are just a part of, of the entirety of what is written. There is, a, there is treasure throughout this book. It's just a matter of taking the time to get into it uh, because it does offer us understanding. It does offer us wisdom. Uh, it does give us uh, light into the darkened areas of our lives, exposing things uh, that need to be exposed in order for us to walk in the purity of God's light. And this is, this is the wonder of this word. Um, it is a lamp to our feet and a light to our path. It prevents us from stumbling and causing a lot of pain with cracking our feet up against a post or something um, you know so uh, it, this word is is important to be in and I guess that's the message for us today uh, don't stop being in this word uh, because the word is your promise it's your hope it's your strength and especially in times like this in darkened times it can be uh, it can be a light uh, in the midst of all the things that darken our lives. So may God's blessings be upon you this day and be a blessing and we'll see you the next time.